this is hard work. It's uh, they've taken some of the manpower out of it with the use of their tractors and their trucks. But they're still hard back back breaking work. As you've seen, the way those people gotta lift those scoops. And uh, we're not lifting 40 and 50 pounds here, we're lifting for all what's in us. And then when you get this out in the fields and you're spreading it out and breaking it up, that's mostly all done by hand. This is um, a lot of kelp. There's mostly all kelp in this. There's a little bit of uh, rockweed, but uh, in this particular area where we got this, and you'll get some Irish moss. This is the Irish moss right here. See, see how this is so like crinkly? And this is the kelp, of course. primary use will be as a livestock mineral. That will be its highest value added uh, product. However, the, the waste product that would contain more impurities will be used as a, a fertilizer. And this here is a very simple process in the sun-dried, it's a completely natural form. It can do great things, things like the immune system of a cow. I believe this here contains over 60 minerals of the 104 that a cow needs in order to survive. So the other thing that's really important to note is it's an organic source of mineral and the uptake by the cow is so much better than an inorganic source. We did the same thing as we did with the uh, potatoes. We divided it into three and one uh, section we put it on at a certain rate and then the next section we put it on at half the rate and then the third one we didn't put any on. See your fruit growing right to the top of the vine like that. That's the way you want to see them. Instead of growing this extra vine, too much fertilizer is just growing more vine but no fruit. So we want to see that kind of a coverage there. We got to get the people, the, the people and the public, to realize what, what what's what's more important in this life. Is it their health, or is it to be being saturated in chemicals? This could be an enormous, enormous huh? for the environment. We got to get the people to care.